Oh, good evening and welcome. We're going to begin in Faulkner County tonight where the city of Conway is hard at work preparing for the great North American eclipse. Of course, the state of Arkansas is expected to attract one and a half million tourists for that event in April. Folks who wish to be in the narrow path of totality are coming here. Channel 7's Desmond Nugent is in Conway with how they're getting ready. Desmond. There's a lot of excitement and buzz surrounding the total eclipse. Places like UCA say they expect a big crowd. There's not a lot of movement here at the University of Central Arkansas that will soon change come April 8th for the total eclipse. We don't know. We've got over 50,000 of these glasses, though, so we're not saying we're going to have that many people, but certainly we're ready to accommodate a large group. Whitehead says they will have many events leading up to the big day, such as a speaker from NASA, musical performers, viewing parties, and much more. We wanted to make sure that it wasn't just one day. It's not just April 8th. There are many opportunities for the Central Arkansas community to connect with UCA leading up to the eclipse. A historic event brings concerns over traffic flow, which could disturb any needs for first responders. Preserve the way that the city functions, both on what you see every day with the streets and all that and public safety, but on the back end with our radio communications, telecommunications, uh, we're doing uh, quite a bit right now to make sure that um, uh, we can tackle it head on. Kelly says there will be huge signs where events will be held. He says people should expect the flow of traffic to be different than normal on April 8th. Kelly emphasizes keeping up with the city of Conway updates on social media leading up to the big day. On your side in Conway, Desmond Nugent. OK, Desmond, thank you. And to find out more about the events UCA has planned, just check out this story on KATV.com.